Welcome back to BRC Blitzball Ranked Championships. We have number nine ranked Patrick Jacob versus number 13, Tyler Davis. And these two are on a completely different trajectory. After the Blitzball World Series, Patrick Jacob has been our biggest riser in the rankings, going from 22 all the way up to nine. And on the other side of things, Tyler Davis did drop a bit after the Blitzball World Series. Had a little bit of a disappointing appearance in that tournament. Who do you think has got the upper hand here? Man, this one's going to be a close game. I mean, I think Patrick has him on the upper hand at pitching, but Tyler's just an elite hitter. So it's really going to come down to who gets guys on and gets a couple clutch hits here and there. Pitching, who knows? I, I can't even call it. It's going to be so close. And these two guys in particular have some of the best drop balls in all of well, Patrick Jacob and Tyler Davis have two of the best. Let's go down to the field for some player interviews. You have risen 13 spots. What do you think your biggest strength is heading into this game? I mean, I think the hard pitching is going to carry me through it. As long as I'm locating, I'm set. What are your thought process in the box against him? Well, I haven't seen him well in the past, but I'm hoping seeing him for a few ABs in a row, I should be able to get on it. And I'm not looking for home runs today, but just putting a couple in play, I think that'll work for me. Tyler Davis, you have recently fell out of that top 10, but this is your chance to get back in. You're at 13, you're facing Patrick Jacob. What are your thoughts headed into this? Uh, I had a really bad tournament, so I would like to do a lot better today, prove that I am pretty good at blitz ball, but he's a good pitcher. I can, I think I can hit him. It'll, it'll be fun. Have fun, play well. Everything's coming together here. All right, stay short, stay short. Let's do it. Here we go, number nine versus number 13 in the blitz ball rankings. First pitch from Patrick Jacob, ball one. Oh, we're feeling lovely today. Biofreeze in the blood. It's the best thing for blitz ball. And on the bump to start, drop ball lands it. That is his signature pitch. Sometimes he even throws that as his like accuracy pitch. It's crazy how often he throws it. Oh, oh Tyler saw that pretty well on the drop, but a good sign that he has seen it there early. Okay, just another strike. Let's see if he can continue to read these pitches here. Slider, ground ball, right back to Patrick Jacob, out number one, field it cleanly. Keep throwing that, keep throwing that. I don't hate that at all, only thing I'd say. Weak contact, sometimes better than no contact. I just gotta say, short, don't get on top of it. Tyler seems to be seeing the ball pretty well through that first at bat, a foul ball and then a ground ball. And a slider, lands in the middle of that thing, started right at Tyler, landed for strike one hammering that slider, just slider, slider, slider. It was looking real good. Tyler gets it all the way to the fence for a single. Single for Tyler Davis. One too many sliders, one might say. I mean, three straight. A, a hitter like Tyler's gonna start to see those. And that one was drilled over the first base side. Runner on first for Tyler Davis. Did it die like soon enough I could get to it? Ah, shoot. That's a single, that's one. Second hit of the at-bat, Tyler able to find a way on. I haven't seen Tyler this locked into the plate in quite a while. And Tyler able to work another walk. He's got the bases loaded. One out, he's in the driver's seat here early in the top of the first. Quack, quack. Chases. Oh, I gotta leave that. Comes back with a ground ball, straight back to Patrick, out number two. I'm on top of it. The second rollover straight to him. I need to smash that. Two down and pressure on Tyler to try to get one of those runners in. Two out, base loaded. Yikes. Another drop, big piece of it. Tyler Davis calculating. Another drop and that is straight to center field for a single. Got to score to win. 1-0 ball game now for Tyler Davis, and he is seeing the knuckle drop well here in this one. A lot of people can't say that. Knuckle drop is one of the toughest pitches to hit in all of blitz ball. Tyler is hitting well here in the first. That's a hit, come on. Five and one. Walks him. Tyler now has two runs on the board. Bases are still loaded for him. Call to the bullpen. I'm still in. Make him make pitches, that's all you gotta do. Knuckle drop out. Follow. 
slider oh. and three straight. Right back to Patrick Jacob That's for the third needed. time in the inning. All in all, only let up two runs. That's not too bad in the first inning. Not bad at all. You can easily put yourself up a five spot, but if Tyler Sloan strikes, man, that's going to be difficult. Might be a hat forward kind of day. Because the wind's going this way. Oh my gosh, he's filthy. Just got to be on the screwball here. Fell off some off speeds. We're looking good. Now we're in the bottom of the first. First pitch. Oh, wow, I wouldn't be expecting that at all. One and one. I think number four is the cutest player in this game, though. Can't get a little walk happy. And after the first pitch landed, lead off walk to Patrick Jacob. Ball low. Runner on first for Patrick. Does walk him. Bases loaded. Oh, I need to throw a fastball for a strike. It's, good. it's looking so easy. I don't want that to come back and haunt me, but. Screwball, oh, wow. top of the zone. What a spot. Starts up by the head. Almost impossible to hit that one. Two strikes to Patrick. Goes back oh, with it. Wow. Freezes him. And a backwards K for out number one, Tyler Davis. Definitely found the strikes on him out of that. This is the Tyler Davis that we all know and we all love. It's a tough one. Breaks in. We're gonna open up a little. Swing at those high and ends. Feel good. Good pitch. Sometimes he gets it moving right, sometimes left. That one drops for a strike. Big swing at that one, 79 mile an hour, past him, strike two to Patrick. Oh, just missed. Screwball inside. In the air, hanging up, staying in, Tyler under it. No catch made and that will count as two runs. It did land in the dirt area. That will count as a double for Patrick Jacob and it'll tie up the ball game. Two to two. Way to get under, he just could not make the catch right there. If you're Patrick, wow, you must be feeling disappointed that that ball did not carry. But hey, two runs on the board is two runs on the board. You got to take what you can get. That's what we needed. Bat on the ball, good things happen. Yeah, that was a barrel. That was just straight up in the air. That's, <laughs> that's gone without that wind. It's a blessing for him, not a floor piece. Got some space to work with now. Two runs on the board, tie ball game. Now here in the first. That one fouled off for strike one. Just up. Screwball line and that is out of here. That will hit the five run cap patch of Jacob. The bat came alive there in the first inning and Tyler Davis's back is against the wall. 5-2 ball game. That one was absolutely tattooed and got out of here in a hurry and oppo shot from it. That's it. That might be the hardest I've ever hit a blitz ball off the bat. I'm praying the radar picked it up on the exit below. If you're Tyler, you're feeling the pressure in the box. You gotta at least come up with three runs here. We'll see what he can do. A lot of pressure. Tyler Davis stepping up. He needs three runs in the first pitch from Patrick Jacob. Absolutely disgusting slider for strike one. Comes right back with it. Slider, strike two, freezes Tyler. Inside, three and two, one hit. Foul tip, got a piece, stays alive. Three and two, the count. Hits him up and in, that is a walk. Tyler Davis, able to get a base runner to start it off. He worked his way out of a tough count though. It started, what, two, two? Location, location, location. Oh my gosh, a knuckle drop at the top of the zone. I think that's at least the sixth knuckleball I've hit him with. I think he'll gladly take the hit by pitches. Slider, strike two to Tyler. Another slider, out number one. Patrick Jacob was electric in that at bat. 
He goes, for the three strikes, he goes slider, drop, slider. Disgusting stuff from Patrick. And I think the one thing that separates Patrick Jacob from everyone else is the fact that his off speed is so insanely accurate. It's crazy how often he's able to land it for strikes. <laughs> slider. That thing starts in, and it's been freezing Tyler here in this inning. See if he can turn on one of these. Wow, I don't even know what that was. What was that? A, a little two-seam dropper, sinker, splitter? I don't know what that was. But it landed for a strike, and a screwball fouled off by Tyler. Big piece of it. First time through that. Inside second hit the at-bat, runners on first and second. Tyler is getting hit by pitches and putting runners on. Two runners on, one down. A slider, a big hack in the foul territory. Foul down the first baseline. Wow. Inside portion, strike two. 0-2. Oh, 0-2 oh, delivery. Comes with a screw ball, ground ball straight back to Patrick. Two outs now. Patrick Jacob, one away from securing the W. Keep rolling over, bro. Suck. It's one swing to tie it up. Slips and gets the foul tip for a strike. Completes no problem. A strike is a strike. Inside slider freezes him once again. That inside slider, and there's two strikes. Did go around. <laughs> he did complete the swing, and Patrick Jacob does awesome. defeat number 13 ranked Tyler Davis. Patrick Jacob has been one of the best risers we've ever seen ah. in the football rankings. I'm so bad. He was at 22 at the beginning of the Bulls Forward Series, all the way up to nine he climbed, and then he beats Tyler Davis to solidify his spot. Look good, feel good, except I just look pretty, feel pretty. It's lovely for the program. Go Gainesville. How high do you think this guy can go in the rankings? Man, I think in the future this guy has very good potential to end up in that top five. I mean, if he keeps this run going, I think that'll be sooner than later, but we'll see. Zoom in. Sad, Tyler. That's a sad little duckling. That is a sad duckling. 